Hello everyone, my name is Petri and I'm one of the three developers uh, behind this game that you see on screen. And this game you see on screen it's called Noita. Uh, it's a Finnish word, it means witch. Uh, it's N-O-I-T-A. Uh, this game is going to be out on Early Access on September 24th. We're all very excited about it because we've been working on this game forever. And so what is this game? Uh, okay, this thing is going to collapse here. Which is kind of cool. So let's show you that. So what is this game? This game is a uh, action roguelite, and what's special about it is that uh, what's special about it is that every pixel is simulated, and that's really kind of cool. And I'm here to sort of demonstrate you to you today what that means in practice. And I was just gonna play the game and explain things as I went along, but. You know, one of the things that's really cool about this game is that it's highly emergent and all kinds of things can happen all the time. So I don't know what's going to happen when I'm explaining this game. I will. I have no developer keys turned on, so if I die, that's going to be the end of it. But I will try to do my best. So uh, you can see here... Oh, uh, there's... Uh, uh, okay. It's gonna go well. I think that's Canis. Oh my! Ah! Canis is gonna explode and it's gonna murder those. Ha ha ha! <laughs> so you can see here on the top left here it explains what the material is that I'm mousing over. So you can see this is like freezing vapor. So what happened here is that gas that rose from there is what actually murdered those guys who came to kill me. Uh, so you can see this is water. So. Every pixel being simulated, it means that we're simulating all the liquids, all the sort of sand-like materials. Uh, we're simulating all the gases to fire and sort of rigid bodies and whatnot. It also means that everything's quite um, destructible. So you see here, here's this rusted metal, metal canister. I think it's actually got oil in it, but if I shoot it, it's gonna explode and yeah, it leaves some oil in here and it set things on fire and you can see uh, the fire is actually melt melting the snow so it's the snow is melting into water and while that is uh, don't come here I'm trying to explain things don't disturb me now creatures uh, <clears throat> so when while the snow is being burning you can see there's the steam that's rising so that comes from when water and fire uh, react to each other it's converted into steam and then the steam rises and once it hits the ceiling here it's going to kind of like rain down as water i actually happen to have this four other magic ones so the second one of these my magic ones shoots these fire bolts so you can kind of see it's not the best demonstration of melting the water uh here's some ice Here's some ice as well. I can shoot the ice and the ice breaks. I can use that to sort of murder enemies if I want to. Oh, maybe this is a good place to show the... So if I shoot some fire here, you can see it melts the snow. Kind of like makes these craters and it's it turns into water. And uh, <clears throat> so we're also tracking the materials that you're covered in. So now I'm currently wet because I've gone through this puddle of water it's good because uh, being wet is good because you, you don't get set on fire as easily weather okay, I'm gonna bring out the, my special magic wand here that generates a bunch of oil uh, and my plan was to ignite this oil and set those bastards in fire, but I'm also covered in oil, so maybe this is not going to go all that well, but... Yeah. I'm setting, setting all of this on fire, and look at that! They are being roasted alive! That's, that serves you right for ruining my recordings! Ha ha ha! Ha 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 ha! Ha ha ha! Uh... Now everything is on fire and I'm covered in oil. Uh, being covered in oil is, uh, it also makes you slippery. 
and you will get set on fire more easily and you will burn much longer. So I don't really want to be covered in oil. Uh, there is a magic wand there. I'm just going to try to grab it. Uh, one of the things in the game, as I kind of like mentioned earlier, is everything's kind of destructive. So I have these bombs, so that will allow me to destroy all of this stuff and get in here. Uh, this is not a very good magic wand, so I'm just gonna leave it. But apparently there's all these, all these, um, crates here. I'm just gonna shoot. Let's explode. Just for the funsies, and you can see all this gas and liquid stuff being simulated, which was actually the kind of the point of this video. Uh, there's a guy there shooting, shooting me down there. Hmm. Hmm. Maybe I will. So, oh my, oh my God. Maybe I will just pick this uh, potion here. And this potion's got uh, invisibility liquid in it. So I'm just gonna throw it in here and does myself in invisibility liquid. That should allow me to snook. I mean, sneak. <laughs> sneak past the enemies here. Uh, so they won't notice me. Uh, the problem with invisibility is that if I accidentally get covered in some other material, I will become visible. So, I'm just gonna sneak past these guys. Oh, that's kind of funny. Let me pick that. These magic wands are also like procedurally generated, so you quite don't quite always know what they're gonna do. Uh, this one though looks like it's gonna generate some acid, apparently, and it apparently set me on fire. Uh, maybe I will use the fire to melt some snow. Uh, okay. Guess it's time to murder everyone. Oh my god. So... Uh, this is fine, I'm professional. I know what I'm doing. Yeah, they're dead. Ha ha. And I will bathe in their blood what you get uh, for disturbing me. So I have these perks. So one of the perks that I picked up earlier, you get these perks once you can kind of like complete the level. So I've been playing this game for uh, two levels now. Uh, and one of the perks I picked up is, is this explosion thing. So anytime I take damage, I'm, I explode. Uh, it's not... It's not supremely useful, so I don't know why I picked it up, but it's kind of fun. Uh, so now I'm covered in some blood. And there's these nasty, nasty dudes coming at me. Uh, I was trying to crush him with the ice, but that apparently didn't work. Well. Whatever. Let's kill him. Uh, once you sort of... Oh my god, there's... Oh, there's so many enemies here. Why is everyone trying to kill me all the time? Uh, I'm just gonna run for it. Oh, there's a match. Yeah, okay, I was supposed to do... Uh, now I'm covered in this nasty green stuff, which gives me damage over time. So every time I'm taking damage, I'm also, like, exploding. And once you get far enough down in this in this place you get to this place uh luckily this thing doesn't kill you so it just takes you to a very low hp which i have nine now left but that's perfectly fine so once you get far enough you get into this place and this is sort of a place for you to rest a bit so you get your health back up and you get your ammo back up and you get to use the shop and you get to buy things, which I can't afford right now because I've been playing kind of poorly. And then you get one of these perks, which I have two here. And most importantly, once you get in here, you get to modify the spells and make your own 
own magic spells. But that is uh, another topic and another video that you will have to watch hopefully next week. Uh, anyway, the game's gonna be out on 24th of September. We're all very excited to have everyone play this game and see all the, all the crazy emergent stuff that's gonna happen in this game. I uh, hope you enjoyed this uh, quick watch into what it means that every pixel is simulated in this game. And hopefully I will see you in the game later. Bye!